Hey fun seekers, Wasaga Mike here. I want to welcome everyone at Wasaga Beach and from around the world. This is Fact Up News. Today's episode is a very special one. We have an exclusive interview with the President of the United States of America, Donald J. Trump. Our internal department did some calling around and managed to get an okay from the White House to have this interview aired. Actually, they were calling for pizza and accidentally got the White House and said, hey, do you want to be on the show? And the guy said, okay. So, so anyways, enjoy the exclusive interview with Donald J. Frump, uh, Trump right here on Wasaga Beach TV. Good day, Mr. Trump. Thank you for being on Fact Up News. We appreciate your time, and I hope that my questions are informative and informative to the public as well. My first question is, your tweeting has caused much controversy. Can you or are you able to stop tweeting for just one day? I could wait a year. Okay, that's crap. Why can't your White House staff just take your device away from your two small little hands? As soon as we can, as soon as we can physically do. Yeah, but you'd mostly like get mad at them and fire them like, you know, you're fired. You're fired, you know, like that. But they shouldn't be very worried. I do have a big heart. We're going to take care of everybody. <laughs> Sounds like the same answer you have for your health care system. But anyways. So rumor has it that your wife Melania shares intimate secrets with your daughter Ivanka. Now she whispered something to Ivanka the other day about you wanting to have sex or something. What was it that Melania said? Then he's groveling again. Do any of your children ever come up to you and share secrets with you? None of them come to me. None of them come to me. You claim that you have a very high IQ. So if someone with the same IQ as you came up to you and had a conversation, how would it go, for example? What would they say? We agree with Mr. Trump. We agree. They're very smart people. Wow. And uh, what about the others? You know, when their IQ is low. For example, if their brain was made out of chocolate, it wouldn't fit into an M&M. What about those individuals? They like me. If they like you so much, what would you like them to do for you? If you asked, for example. I want them to fix the problem. Problem? Are you admitting, as you, the President of the United States of America, is the worst president ever? Maybe it's okay if somebody else is president. I want them to fix the problem. The problem is, you're the problem. Who do you want to fix this problem? But they gotta fix the problem. Okay, who... <sighs> Forget it. Forget it. It's like, it's like a hamster going around on a wheel. Man. I say you have to smarten up and you have to toughen up. You're telling me to smarten up and toughen up? Really? Now we got a problem here, mister. I want them to straighten out the problem. It's a big problem. Enough with your problem. Jesus. Let's move on. Now, you know, you should have some people take you away in a straitjacket to a nice little home or something, you know? You're gonna see in about two hours. Okay, can you like answer in like a, a funny voice or something? You know, like your thoughts about your Russian buddy Putin, you know, and uh, in regards to, to uh, keeping prisoners, you know, make it funny. 
who said, I was a little surprised, who said he's not a believer in torture. <laughs> it's pretty good. Um, do it again in another funny voice, you know. E e explain more in detail in, the, in, in, that, in that funny voice. He is, uh, you know, I haven't gone into great detail. Now, in, in Russia, it, it's customary to uh, kiss another man. And when Putin wanted to kiss you, uh, what did you say? And the answer was yes, absolutely. Hmm. And if you and Putin were married, uh, do you think two presidents from two different countries uh, could get married and have a good relationship? Do I feel it works? Absolutely, I feel it works. Well, Mr. Trump, you know, I got to say, uh, I got to, my fear is that I don't think leaders from other countries are going to come on to my show after seeing you <laughs> on this show. But uh, seriously, do you think coming on uh, Fact Up News uh, works? And if they don't want to do it, it's 100% okay with me. Do I think it works? Absolutely. Well, thanks, Donnie. I appreciate that. Thank you for joining me here with President Donnie Trump. Donald. Sorry, buddy. With President Donald J. Frump, uh, Trump right here on Wasaga Beach TV.